Hi you guys, SackBBW916 here, and I wanted to just give you guys a heads up that Sunday, um, July 31st, there should be three or four inserts in your paper. There's supposed to be a Smart Source, two Red Plums, and the PG Saver. So look out for that. Um, you know, if you have an insert schedule that you trust and is usually accurate, check that out. Um, but I've been given a heads up that that's what uh, we're expecting here in the Sacramento area. So be on the lookout for that. Um, with that being said, you know, if you want to go, if you're going to get out and get some uh, extra papers, this is the time, you know, when, you know, the papers are chock full of coupons. Uh, the last time I've seen the paper this full was May 1st when I first started getting the paper um, for couponing. And so, I mean, since then it hasn't been, um, you know, as full. So where can you get some extra papers at? Um, and I've gone over this before, but now, you know, my views are kind of changing a little bit. And I'm going to go over that, uh, try to go over that quickly here for you. Um, and, you know, and I still advocate, you know, the dollar store sells them for a dollar, which is always better than the $2 that you pay at the gas station, Walmart, Walgreens, uh, supermarket, wherever. So dollar is better than $2. Okay, so that being said, home delivery uh, right now is getting a deal for the Sunday paper only. If you just have to have the whole week's paper, you know, that's something different. Uh, but you can still add on to your subscription where you get the... Uh, the $19.99 or $95 for the, just the Sunday. So you can get the week-long seven-day subscription, but then add like two, three, four, five of the uh, Sacramento Bees onto your subscription. Now, you don't get a discount for having multiple subscriptions, which is a bummer. Um, but, and you know, another bummer is, is that you have to pay for them up front. Um, so if I added on to uh, my subscription because I get Friday, Saturday, and Sunday only. And then I added three more uh, subscriptions because basically I'm tired of going out to the Dollar Tree store or the 99 cent only store and <laughs> having to dig through the papers um, when I could just, if I don't get something, I can call my carrier up and say, hey, you know, I was missing the coupons on my paper or, you know, I got home from work and somebody stole my paper. <laughs> so anyway, um, so basically... What happened last week on the 24th was uh, I went and to the Dollar Tree store and you guys saw my CVS uh, and Walgreens haul and I wanted some more of the Scantiment uh, coupons. So what happened was that there was no uh, smart source in the papers and at first I thought, ooh, did somebody go through these and just didn't know that there was a red plum to take too? And so they let me open up a bundle and I opened up a brand new bundle that hadn't been messed with. And there was no smart source in there. And then later on when I went uh, to get the um, papers from the gas stations, then some of them in different areas had uh, yeah, no smart source. Some had no red plum. So it was. I think it was just regional. I think they just ran out of the smart source. But you guys know by now that there's always going to be a smart source. Um, if there's not a uh, insert, if there's only going to be one insert, there's going to be a smart source and they won't have the red plum. So those of you that uh, missed out on the smart source, I'm sorry. But, you know, you might look into adding to your subscription. So, you know, with the 1995, it looks pricey, but if you multiply it out or divide it out by 50, 52 weeks, that's 38 cents. So that's 38 cents as opposed to the dollar eight cents that you're paying at the dollar store, 99 cent only store. If you don't have the funds to pay it up front, then okay. <laughs> but, you know, you're still, you know, I think, um, you know, doing yourself, I won't say disservice, but, you know, you are putting out, I mean, because for, what, three months, I was also like, you know, hey, I'm putting out $60 for, you know, more papers when, you know, you never know. You know, yeah, the days, uh, the week says there's only one insert, you know, there's only one insert. And in the days that there are um, a bunch of inserts, though, you get those. So, you know, it's a personal choice, and I'll leave that up to you guys. Uh, let's see. 
stealing paper and stuff like that. You guys know not to do that. Um, whether it's in the store and you're like trying to sneak out a couple of inserts and stick them in the paper you are going to buy, that's wrong. And I have confronted a lady in the past about that. Not that I'm saying that you guys should do that, but you know, it's wrong. And you know, it'll take one time, even though you guys should be checking your paper, you know, if you get a, a paper that has no inserts in it, um, when, you know, all the other ones did. So, um, anyway, don't do that. And don't encourage other people to do that. Also, Kmart is having a uh, it uh, double coupons this week. It ends today. Uh, there's a Cottonelle deal to be had, uh, and so there's also supposed to be one reportedly at uh, Walgreens. Also, so I don't know. I'm kind of skeptical that the Walgreens one will uh, work. So I'm going to try to do um, going out today, Saturday, and try to do the Cottonelle one at Wal uh, Kmart. I went out last night. Uh, and they didn't have any, so I got a rain check. I'm not sure how the Catalinas will work with that, if they're able to print out the Catalinas or not. Um, so, basically, what the deal is, is that you would, uh, you know, the Cottonelle is $4.99 for a 12-pack roll, uh, the double rolls. You pay uh, $4.99, you know, so times three, that's uh, $14.97. Uh, you use your 75 cents off coupons, which would double to $1.50, so that's $4.50 off. And then it would print you out a $4.50. Oh, you pay like $10.47 plus tax. It'll print you out a $4.50 register reward. So um, then you roll that into the next transaction where you can get two. Or if you want, you could do three again. And it will um, print you out a $3.50 register reward. So if you get uh, two, you get $3.50. If you get three, you get $4.50. So basically, it breaks it down to you would pay like a dollar eighty nine plus tax for five rolls, uh, five uh, sets of twelve of Cottonelle. Now the deal at Walgreens is is that on the thirty first only, there's going to be an overlap in the Catalina that was printing out for the month of July on August first. Plus there's a coupon for a dollar in the August book for uh, what's that for Cottonelle. So you can do the same kind of deal, $3 or $2, uh, I'm sorry, three packs or two packs, uh, $4.50 for three, $2.50 for two, and it works out to be like $1.50. So I'm not sure how that is. Maybe they're not factoring tax. But anyway, if it doesn't work, and of course, you know, they're, you know, if, it, if the machine beeps, they're not going to want to take it. <laughs> so um, I would rather try to do the deal at Kmart, doubling the coupon, than at Walgreens hoping for a, um, a oversight and somebody putting in the wrong date. So anyway, so that was that. Uh, the Cascade coupon is supposed to be in the uh, July 31st PG Saver. So look for that. And that's pretty much all I got for you uh, this week. I did do some shopping yesterday and I'll try to do a, post a video. Um, I'm going to try to get to the point where I can post the videos earlier in the week. You know, do my shopping earlier in the week. But um I don't know, it's kind of hard with the um, the stocking uh, schedule, like for the stores in this area. Uh, usually it's midweek, so it's really hard for me. Plus, you know, usually I try to work during the week. I'm only obligated to work one week in a month. So usually my work schedule is during the week. Um, and so I tend not to go out too much um, unless it's right after work. Um, so I'll try to work on that. And um, that way you guys can take part in some of these deals and not just hear about them after the fact. <laughs> But anyway, so I apologize for the avatar, but if there was ever a day to have an avatar, today was it. <laughs> so I am still going to go out and uh, see if I could do some last minute deals. Um, and hopefully you guys are, you know, working on your deals for this upcoming week with all these great coupons coming out. Um, you can look up Sunday Coupon Preview. Um, you can Google it and take a look at it, see what's uh, expected to come out. Also, there are sites that you can look at your favorite stores like iHeart Rite Aid. You know, you spell out the word iHeart uh, Rite Aid, iHeart CVS, iHeart Wags. I don't think there's one for Target, but, um, you know, probably nobody loves Target. So, <laughs> no, I'm just joking. Target's not one of my favorite ones, but... Mm. But anyway, you know, there are other website blogs that you could check. You know, the Crazy Coupon Lady and Coupon Divas are two that I use uh, regularly. Uh, Coupon Mom, because they have a sortable list that you could look at a glance. 
to see which uh, items you can get for free or 90%. Like I said, my stockpile is pretty, pretty, pretty full. Um, so, you know, pretty much I'm just doing like uh, stuff that I'm going to send down to my mom or, um, you know, I have a friend that now gives me money to shop for her. So um, unless I'm doing some kind of deal for her, I'm only after like the 90% of or above deals. So anyway, with that being said, I will let you go. Talk to you later. Bye.